Hello and welcome to another Nihongo Gamer video. Easter comes early for Nihongo Gamer subscribers because today I'm going to show you an Easter egg that I have seen on the internet. Videos have been going around that have basically shown um, a bonus hidden game in the browser on the new Nintendo 3DS. Now, if you type in the music to Super Mario like this, da 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 da. You can actually get um, a new screen that says Stage Select. You type in any um, any link that you want to see, and it will turn that link into a breakout game. So this is com a complete secret. There's it's not written in the manual anywhere, and basically the, you wouldn't. There's, I don't really know how the guy discovered that you could do this. But it's fully playable. You can actually move this around, and you can actually finish the game. There's a little surprise at the end when you finish it, and actually you can make your own puzzles by typing in any link that you want. So basically I'm going to show you exactly how it's done, a little demo of the game. Let's get stuck in and play the breakout easter egg for the new Nintendo 3DS. Alright, as you can see I've got my new Nintendo 3DS here, it's got the Boo cover plates on it, they're really really nice. Um, there's actually an unboxing for that on a separate video on the channel, so you can check that out later. But for now, just open up your new Nintendo 3DS and open up the browser. Grab your stylus and just tap in the Super Mario theme tune anywhere that is not a link so this is like a link area just tap it here at the top like this da, 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 and it will change to the word stage select and then you can just choose any link you like and you can play the game using the d-pad you can also use the analog stick it is actually surprisingly difficult this game um, it's it's quite demanding um, I'm not very good at it yet in order to show you what happens actually when you finish the game I have loaded up a custom link now I actually um, amended this link earlier because I couldn't be bothered to actually play the whole level and basically Basically you'll see when you finish the level you get these wonderful little fireworks, only two, um, which is a little bit of a shame, and then it just ends. Basically even if you choose a link like this with the sound up, there is no sound, and the, I tried it earlier, there's no sound even when you finish um, a complete game, which is a shame. It does have the score here in the side, which is really cool. If you want to make your own link like I had just done, basically you choose the favorites button over here, choose the spanner icon for the link you want to change, and this is where you would type it in. So I typed in a single dash, but you could just as easily easily make it a bunch of zeros or I don't know um, a bunch of H's anything you like stage select and choose it and it will be whatever you just made so you can make you could probably make some really interesting stages um, using this this is about as creative as I could manage to be I typed this in basically I could get um, full stops zeros hyphens uh, periods that sort of thing I could get them to work but nothing like at symbols dollar signs percent signs um, none of them actually work so you're gonna have to make your levels using only these materials I've just discovered this now but if you hold down the pen on the um, touch screen, you can actually control the um, the breakout bar using the touch screen. So that is really interesting. I had no idea. I just discovered that by accident just now. All right, so there you have it, guys. Basically, you tap in the tune, you choose your level, and you can actually make your own levels. Um, and basically, you can control it with these uh, the slide pad, with the um, directional pad, or you can even move it around using the touch stylus. That is fantastic. And you can really, you know, you can just count on Nintendo to come up with cool stuff like that. That's so awesome. So there you have it guys, don't forget to comment, subscribe, show the links and all that good stuff, and I will see you in the next video. It actually feels lighter to hold than you. You're better off just watching video in the browser. It's nice if you want to play your DS games with a larger screen.